What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and it is time to start Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. So I bought whatever this is. What, what on earth did they call it? This thing, the Pokeball Plus. That's what we bought. I'll move the face cam around. I haven't started the game up really. I started it up to kind of attempt to get audio. But other than that, I didn't, I didn't really do anything. But point is, is I bought this bad boy. And so the center here, this little thing, is how you walk around and you move and whatnot. And you can also click A there. The top is a button. I'm not entirely sure what button the top is, but it's a button. So, yeah, there we go. Let's go ahead and hop on into this, though. So I think all you got to do to catch Pokemon in this is to throw it. I mean, I'm going to spend most of the time spinning it around my finger like this, but yeah, I think, I think you just throw, unless, unless you just go like this and you don't even have to throw it. I don't know. So I believe you hit the top button. Actually, oh, I have to like resync it. There we go. It's like that. So shake top button is quit. Press the control stick to confirm. Shake for other. Okay. All right. Let's get into this. This is kind of weird. It's got like the finger strap here, and like I get that, but like I guess you're supposed to move this forward so it fits your wrist, and then this goes like that. I guess. I guess only that's like really weirdly awkward. Okay, so we're to the language, but like, what is this? Like, I hate when chords do that. Like, hold on, I'm gonna fix it. It's this side. Oh no, I almost just preferred if the Pokeball, you know, didn't do whatever this is. Like, it's my fault if I throw it across the room. Like, I understand that. Like, all right, and now it's like awkward to hold. Okay, English, we all know that. Let's begin the game. I'm gonna end up, I mean, actually it's kind of, that's nice. It's kind of on a dolly when you pull your hand back, kind of comes back. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People are affectionately referred to me as the Pokemon Professor. I really hope... This is, like, really loud compared to the menu music. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. And if you want to know how people tend to interact with these Pokemon, while some people keep them as companions, others have them do battle. As for myself... Yeah, you study Pokemon, we all know. I study Pokemon as a profession. I'm going to just be playing with this the whole time. Now, why don't you tell me about yourself? So, if you want to know how this works, this is the top, this is the bottom. So, if you flick this up, it, it goes up, and then down, it's down. That's how you know. So, I'm going to pick this character. I'm going to be a boy on this character. I also bought Let's Go Eevee as well to play when I'm not recording. So, when I'm not at home. And I'll probably play as a girl in there. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You gotta... Okay, so... I have to learn these controls. Alright. Right, so your name is Nick. Yes, sir. This boy here is your friend and rival who has grown up next door to you. What, what was his name now? So, I always, when I was a kid, I had a neighbor who was a little bit older than me, but he actually gave me my first video games. So, 
name him after him. And he actually, he introduced me to Pokemon. So I think it's a fitting name to continue naming the rival Blake. Hmm, I see, his name is Blake. I like how Pikachu is leading us around the intro here. Your very own Pokemon tale is about to unfold. Also, this little bad boy gets you Mew. Now, I'm not exactly sure how you get Mew, but it says on the back of the box, I threw the box across the room. Okay. It says your Pokeball accessory contains Mew. You bring, you can bring this rare Pokemon to your Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu or Let's Go Eevee game. Internet connection is required. So I will make sure and get that unlocked. But yeah, this is pretty, for what this is, being just a little ball, it is pretty fluid. I mean, you can run around with it. Works out really well. I'm coming up. Pokemon has still yet to hire voice actors. Up and at him. Morning, Nick. What's going on? You've got one weird look on your face. Ah, never mind that. I couldn't wait any longer, so I came to get you. Today is finally the big day. We're finally going to get our first Pokemon from Professor Oak and become real trainers. Oh, but before we do, you read the email I sent you yesterday, right? You better you better have. Check your computer if you didn't. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna book it to Professor Oak's lab, so see you there. Ha, joke's on you. You can't actually get your Pokemon until I show up. So the one issue that I'm gonna have with this is that I'm gonna play with this, like this, and then I'm gonna lose track of where the ball is. So that's like what I'm doing while I'm talking is playing with the ball, but I'm gonna lose track of which way it's facing. Hey Nick, here's what you need to know as a trainer. Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't need you to teach me how to do this. I've been playing Pokemon since like 1997. Maybe not that long. That would mean I was playing when I was two. That is probably not accurate. Let's talk to our mom. Come on. Come on, mom. There we go. Off you go to Professor Oak's lab. Blake, Blake asked the professor to give the two of you Pokemon of your own, didn't he? Okay, so uh, one thing I wanted to check. So this opens up the menu. It said shake. Okay, so there that... Okay, so that popped open the menu. I don't, I don't know. We'll leave that on for now. I'm going to turn the music down just a little bit. We'll turn. We'll turn it to there for now. Um, movie skipping. Is there a Pokemon Go setting? Let's check these out. Pokemon, da, 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 your game specific user ID and data about your game will be transmitted to Pokemon Go. No, not, well, not, not, not right now. On, go back. I don't want to do it right now. I'll get that later. Controller settings. Oh, okay. So here's how you switch controllers. So if I wanted to use, I don't even know if I can use, this doesn't show up as an option. So I don't even know if I can use um, my controller. It doesn't matter. We're using this thing. I've. I bought this thing. It was like 40 bucks. It's 50 if you don't buy it with the game, which blows my mind. Okay, c come on. There we go. We're good. Oh, good. It's going to show me how to attach the poke. But this is really cool. If you pull your hand back, it pulls it back into your hand. Okay, enough jacking around. Now, did that save? So I gotta shake this. It did not save. How do you? Oh, you gotta confirm. You gotta. You gotta confirm and quit. There we go. Okay. So if any of the audio was loud, that for sure fixed it. These graphics are pretty nice. So I'm playing on my TV, obviously, because I'm sitting in my normal setup. Clearly, I'm playing at my TV. But point is, point point is, is this is the best looking Pokemon game we've ever had, which would make sense. This is the best hardware a Pokemon game has ever been on. So I'm going to assume this is the lab. I don't actually remember this game all that much. 
Oh, look, he already took his Pokemon. Oh, Nick, Professor Oak isn't here. Do you think those Pokebots hold the Pokemon you and I are supposed to get? I can't wait to get mine. I actually don't remember what Pokemon he gets in this one because I get Pikachu. I also study Pokemon as Professor Oak's assistant. What do you do? Professor Oak may not look like much, but he's the authority on Pokemon. Many Pokemon trainers think highly of him. Is this the one where I gotta walk out into the... Yeah, gotta walk out into the grass and say Professor Oak. Well, my good Pidgey, thanks for the help. Okay, maybe not. I think I understand you all a bit better now, thanks to this. Ah, if it isn't Nick. Oh, of course, I promised to give you and Blake your Pokemon today, didn't I? Well, in that case, why don't we head over to... Hmm? What? What's this? Oh, the instant... Oh, no, it's going to teach me how to catch a Pokemon. Oh, you encountered a wild Pikachu. My, my, I surely wouldn't have expected a Pikachu to appear around here. But since the opportunity has presented itself, why don't we practice some Pokemon catching? You just have to throw out your Pokeball and try to land it on a wild Pokemon for the chance to catch it. Okay, hold your Joy-Con horizontally and point it straight. I'm going to assume this is straight at the screen. Press A button to ready a Pokeball. I don't get ready. You can throw your Pokeball by waving your Joy-Con. So, don't forget your surroundings. Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't know about the noise. I don't know about the noise coming out of this. But alright, you caught a Pikachu. This is really sweet. This is like super awesome that this is how it works. That was a pretty fine performance for a first timer, my boy. Why don't you pick up that Pokeball and give that Pikachu you caught a name? So, hmm, what in the? Now that's a lively Pokemon if I've ever seen one. Hey, wait, come back. Professor Oak? Those Pokeballs there, I swear there were only two a second ago, but now there are three. A perfectly reasonable reaction, my boy. You see, one of them is a Pikachu that Nick caught just now. So wait, Nick, you caught it yourself? Wah, I've never seen that happen before. Ho ho ho, how interesting. I miss the days where your rival was actually your rival. Like, they were a douchebag and they didn't like you. I miss those days of rivals in Pokemon games. Well, my boy, this is it. Take that Pokeball and keep good hold of it this time. Okay. What if I don't pick the middle one? Okay. I wonder what starter they took away here. Oh, yeah, look at that magical connection. Can this Pikachu please walk around on my shoulder? This will make this game, like, so much cooler. This is gonna be fun, having, like, Eevee and Pikachu out with you. Especially with, like, graphics this good. Pikachu became your Pokemon. Hmm, what a strange Pokemon indeed. It sure doesn't seem to like staying in one place. But it looks as tough... It looks as though it's taken a shine to you, Nick. Why not give it a name? See, I like... I like don't name my Pokemon. Like, it's always a thing I want to do, but then I never do it because I always come up with the stupidest names. So I'm always like, what was the point of naming this? I just want the regular name. So, 
I'm sure there's a name tutor, so if I think of a better th naming theme or if someone can think of a naming theme, let me know. I was thinking about doing like NFL or NBA players, but once again, it's pretty lame. So, you know, I could do like anime characters, but that's pretty lame too. So, you know, yeah, I guess it doesn't have to be a naming theme, but it's easier to name stuff with a naming theme. Like if I just give these Pokemon random names, it, it, I don't know. It makes sense, but it, it's also stupid. So we're going to skip the nickname. But if someone comes up with a better naming scheme than NBA, NFL players, anime, random names, could just go random name generator. I guess there's not really a bad place where I face cam. I'm just looking now. There's really not a good place or a bad place. I guess the best place is probably at the top of the screen. That probably makes the most sense. So I'm going to move it up there. So, no, not... Let's just move. Okay, so we're going to move the face cam up to the top. Move it right there. And move the overlay. Just the little growing pains for episode one. Okay. Okay. Professor, I choose this one. Blake got an Eevee from Professor Oak. Okay, so he just gets the opposite. So when I play the other one, when I play Eevee, he's going to get Pikachu. All right, Oak. Oh, it's really cute, Eevee. It's really cute. Eevee is just what I wanted. Hey, Nick, let's have a battle. For a new trainer to catch their first Pokemon themselves, even if I've never seen such a thing, even if I... That, just, that sentence didn't make sense. So... Oh, just one more thing. Now that you two are setting out as trainers, I'd like to ask your help with something. Take this with you on your journeys. Yeah, give me that Pokédex. What is that thing, Professor? This is the Pokédex that I've designed. It automatically records data on Pokémon you've seen or caught, and it makes an entry for each. It's an extremely high-tech tool. Nick and Blake, I want you each to take one with you. Yo, Professor Oak's got, like, next-level next style going on. He's got a polo with one button. You got a Pokédex from Professor Oak. You'll find you can't get very detailed data on Pokemon by just seeing them. You must catch a Pokemon to gather the most complete data. To make a complete guide to all the Pokemon in the world, that was my dream. But I'm an old man now. Too old to get the job done myself. That's why I want you young trainers to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. A Pokedex, huh? We're gonna meet so many Pokemon. This keeps getting better and better. I'm setting out right now. Nick, you should do the same. If you think you're ready, that is. I don't know. I thought I was just, you know, hang out in Professor Oak's lab for the remainder of the game. Oh, how cute. This is the one you got from the professor? What? You caught it yourself? That's amazing. What should I call your new friend? Pikachu. It's a lovely Pokemon. My how I I enjoy how they have the the voices for the Pokemon, but we didn't get voice actors for the people. My how energetic! I suppose that means you two will be setting off on an adventure today, right? I thought this day might come soon, so I planned ahead and got this for you. Town map. Thanks, mom. You put the town map in your bag. By using that town map in your bag, you'll always know exactly where you are. Safe travels, dear. You and Pikachu be good to each other. Okay. And Pikachu does follow me around. It looks like it's enjoying the warmth of the sun. Alright, let me explore this real quick sometime. Eh, I don't think so. Like I said, I don't remember much about the original game. I want to say there was an item in one of these patches to start the game, but... No, not Pikachu. All I remember, the main thing I remember is like fire red and leaf green. I would like hunt through these stupid patches of flowers for rare candies and crap. Oh, that classic music. What do you gotta say, kid? See those le- uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I jump from the ledges, yeah, okay. 
So, oh my gosh, this is like... So, I get this, like, Pokemon Go, but does that mean I, like, don't encounter anything in the grass? The grass is just kind of there because it was there in the original game. All right, let's catch ourselves a Pidgey. I don't know how many Pokeballs I have. I'll have to see. Oh, you encountered a wild Pidgey. How much? Okay, so our bag. Okay, I have 50 Pokeballs. Okay. This is, like, really easy to... Oh, this is cool! This thing lights up! Like, it's actually catching the Pokemon in this ball. Alright. I can dig it. And this is how you get... This is how you get experience points, is by catching. There are no longer battles with wild Pokemon. I think there's battles with... Pe there Obviously, there's battles with people. Otherwise, this would just be an adventure game, and I don't think it's that. Literally did no research on this game. I just knew I was going to get it because it's Pokemon, so... I was like, I'll just learn as I go. Like, I uh, I was going to go back and get the Rattata. With 50 Pokeballs, I'm just going to catch them. What was that? So do I have to aim it like this? Oh, there's like a... Okay. There's like a getting used to this. This is like... Huh. There we go. I'm gonna throw it like this. I can, can, I think I can control it better. Throwing it like that. This is a little bit dicey on how to play this exactly. I'll figure out how to get Mew between episodes. Okay, let me get this Rattata. I need to get, I want to catch as many Pokemon as I can. Come here, Rattata. A little bit off the mark. It's gonna take some getting used to throwing this. I'm sure it's easier to throw like the Joy-Con. Or with I don't know how you throw with the dot with the undocked connected thing. I wonder if it's just flick the stick. Pikachu's level six already. Nice. With 50 Pokeballs, I'm gonna be catching everything. So Pikachu got quick attack. Radita added to the Pokedex. Will chew on anything with its fangs. If you see one, you can be certain that 40 more live in the area. Okay. Is this a trainer to battle? No. No item. You've got a pretty sweet Pokemon with you. I'll bring along my favorite Pokemon later, so you'd better battle me when I do. So I have to remember to come back and battle you? Alright, Viridian City. I don't really need to... Yeah, I was gonna say. I don't really need to do anything in the Pokemon Center. I really, really... Did you know there are actually two kinds of Caterpillar Pokemon? Yes. Okay, then good. There's, what it is, is, so this is Gen 1, so there's Cater, no, that's Gen 3. Oh my gosh, I can't, I'm stupid, what, what, the Gen 1 ones, what? No, Gen 1 is Caterpie and Weedle. Oh, well, Gen 3 is whatever evolves in the Duskass and Beautifly. You must know Professor Oak, right? I've got a delivery for him, but I really can't leave the Pokemon unattended right now. Can I get you to take this to Professor Oak for me? Parcel. Put the parcel in your bag. Thanks, kid. Say hi to Professor Oak for me, too. Do you want to head straight back to the lab? Yes, I do. Oh, good. They just did a fast travel instead of making me walk. Why, Nick? Back so soon? How is little Pikachu doing? Hmm? Hmm? See, this is what I'm hoping is the regular thing, is that he just chills on my shoulder. That's much cooler than him waddling behind me. Goodness me, Pikachu here seems like it's really come to be a true partner to you, Nick. I think you've got what it takes to become a great Pokemon trainer. What's that? You have something for me? He handed the professor his parcel. 
Oh, so my order arrived. Thank you for bringing it to me. Hey, Professor Oak, it's about my Eevee. Its moves are... Whoa, Nick, that's so cool. Pikachu just rides on you like that? Ah, and now we have Blake as well. What fine timing. I've just been delivered some very handy items, which I think I'll share with the two of you. Raspberries. So we're going to get all the... So it's all the Pokemon Go items. Put the raspberries in your catching pocket. Great, I've been starving. I'll stop you right there, son. Those berries are for Pokemon to eat, not you. When you want to catch a Pokemon, try throwing one of these at your target before you take a Pokeball in hand. You'll find that wild Pokemon will become will, will be so happy to have a berry to nimble on that they'll become much easier for you to catch. That was close. I nearly swallowed one of them right up myself. Now then, you two. It's up to you to decide if you want to catch lots of different Pokemon or simply focus on training up your favorites. My only crust is that you have fun either way. Wait up! Come on, Nick. You do know you can do more with Pokemon than just catch them, right? If you're a trainer, you can have Pokemon battles with other trainers, too. I'll show you exactly what I mean. It's battle time. Did he catch it? He has his one solo Pokemon. There is zero chance you're beating me. Oh, this is... Woo, this is like the best Pokemon game. I will say, I thoroughly enjoyed Alpha Sapphire and Omega Ruby. Those were like the last ones that I enjoyed. But my point with those is that they're remakes, so I don't really count them as like a full-fledged game. The last fully-fledged game, I thought I just made a mistake. The last fully-fledged game that I really loved... I mean, I liked all of them, but this would be the best game since probably Pokemon. I, one of the GameCube ones, either Gale of Darkness or Shadow Coliseum. It doesn't really matter which one you prefer, but I like both of those. I think as the top Pokemon games. I really like the old ones on the Game Boy Advance. But I think... Ob Objectively, there's been better ones since then. But this, just from the start here, this is going to take some good... I, I have to hold the Pokeball a certain way. But point is, is that I this is one of the best Pokemon. I, I know it's a remake, but it's like a really high quality remake. 32 XP. Pidgey, Grudel, I don't care about... None of these are making it through any decent amount of the game with me. Pidgey might just simply because it'll have fly, but I believe you can get starter Pokemon, so I'll get Charizard. There I went mouthing off like I knew everything, and then I lost. How embarrassing. I probably should have trained my Pokemon up a bit before battling, before trying a battle like that, huh? Let's battle again sometimes. Did you enjoy your first taste of battle, young Nick? Your partner Pikachu seemed to like it. All right, back. Oh, who is this? Hey, Nick. Oh, just look at Pikachu. You two are already looking like great partners, and I've got the perfect little gift for such a great team. Here, take this. Sportswear from your friend's big sister. Put the, spo the sportswear in your clothing trunk. Try putting that on Pikachu. You can go on an adventure in matching clothes. Oh. So I can play dress up with my Pikachu. Pikachu looks very happy. Play with Pikachu, Joy-Con. You can pet Pikachu. Okay. Oh, oh, where'd my hand go? Hand. What the? Where is my hand? I'm sorry, Pikachu. I can't. Where'd my hand go?
go. Oh my gosh, this is so hard to control. Uh, so hard to control. Give me one of these. Give me one of these. There you go, buddy. Okay. Check out. Now, how do I? I thought I could equip something on him. Hee hee, it seems like Pikachu wants to play. Don't forget to show it some love from time to time. Play with Pikachu has been added to the menu screen. Press X button to see. Select this option to play with Pikachu whenever you want. <laughs> okay, so. Where? Clothing trunk. Choose an outfit for Pikachu. Oh, buddy. You, oh my gosh, this is going to be so much fun. I literally can't do anything. All right. All right, sweet. Is this the Pokemart guy? Thanks for helping me out with that parcel. The Pokemart is a convenient chain selling all sorts of items, so please come visit us. Why are you just sitting here? Oh, I know. I'll give you a sample. Here you go. Thanks for the potions. Your Pokemon may take damage when you battle other trainers. Be sure to use a potion on them if that happens. Alright. Pidgey, leave me alone. I don't need another Pidgey. We do need an Oddish. So let's go ahead and catch the Oddish. Oh, you encountered a wild Oddish. There we go. Nice throw. This is going to take some getting used to. There we go. Early in the game, everything's going to be nice and easy. I'm looking forward to the battles that we're going to have with, like, legendary Pokemon to catch them. Pikachu got the level 7. Nice. Pointless Pidgey and Rattata levels. Oddish data will be added to the Pokédex. I really enjoy this because you can go catch the Pokemon that you want. I mean, obviously I'm going to try to catch everything, but at least now you can catch the Pokemon that you want. Trainer's eyes have met. I'll battle you with my favorite Pokemon. I wish, like, to start the battle you'd throw this out, but... Well, maybe you do. Well, Pikachu's on my shoulder, so I don't think I'll have to throw it out. But you can't tell me that wouldn't have been a sweet feature. To throw, like, Pikachu out there out of his Pokeball. That would have been freaking epic. Why well, I just one-shot this Rattata. Really, your favorite Pokemon got one shot, bro? Pidgey got to level 6. I beat youngster Ronnie. Wow, Ronnie, you are terrible. Thanks for the Pokeballs and the 60 bucks. What do you want now, Blake? Huh, you look pretty pleased about something, Nick. Oh, you beat another trainer. Good job. Well, since we're on the topic, the Pokemon you sent into battle might have lost some HP or PP. You should take them to the Pokemon Center and get them healed up. It doesn't cost any money and doesn't take long at all either. Just remember, heal up after battles. I normally would, but I used one Thunderbolt and it died. Don't need to go to the Mart. I got potions. What is this? Trainer school. Okay. I think this is a good spot to call it for episode one. And the next one, I think we'll head into the trainer school. See if there's anything important I need to do in there. And other than that, we got a gym. Which is not going to be friendly to Pikachu. But we do have an Oddish. So that should help with that gym. Uh, but yeah, guys. That's going to do it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I'm looking forward to doing a lot more Pokemon videos. Um... I'll give updates or I'll show different stuff that I find on my EV version because I'll probably play farther ahead in that one. Um, but Pikachu is my favorite Pokemon Gen 1. Yeah, favorite Gen 1 Pokemon, slightly edging out Charizard. Um, so I wanted to do Pikachu for the series so I could be excited. Um, but yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.